everybody, welcome to Reading with Babia. In today's video, we are going to be continuing to look at fables. Um, the text is called Aesop's Fable, written by Michael Rosen. For those of you that watched my very first storytelling video, you may recognise this front cover. Now, in today's video, we are going to be reading the text Cockerel, Dog and Fox. It is personally one of my favourite fables within this storybook. So, here is a picture from the text. Now, as you can tell, the actual fable is quite a short one. And there is always a message at the bottom. So, let's begin. Dog and Cockerel were good friends, and they were strolling down the road together. When night came, they set about finding somewhere to sleep. Cockerel flew up into a tree, while Dog rolled around in a hollow in the ground down below. They each had a good sleep, and when the sun started to appear in the sky, Cockerel stirred, threw back his head, and had and let out a great <coughs> away in the woods who should hear the noise but fox and it wasn't long before he was there at the foot of the tree oh is that you singing asked fox i woke up this morning hearing such a heavenly sound and i asked myself what gorgeous creature can it be that makes such sweet music I must find the beautiful beast right now or I'll hate myself for not looking for the rest of my days. And then, what do you know? Cockerel, it's you. Come down, you wonderful bird, and let me shake the hand of the owner of the most beautiful voice I've ever heard. It will be my great pleasure, said Cockerel. But why don't you come up and see me? All you have to do is wake up Dorman down there, get him to open the door, and then come on up. So Fox woke up Dog, and Dog snarled and snapped and tore Fox apart quicker than it takes a leaf to fall from a tree. And that's the end of the fable. Now the message, or the moral, is if someone stronger than yourself is attacking you, or if you think someone is trying to get the better of you, with clever words, then go and get help from someone who can defend you. I hope you enjoyed the fable. See you later. If you haven't already, please do like, comment and subscribe. I will see you all in the next storytelling video. Bye bye. Take care.